This will explain how you link a button to another page of buttons, or page linking is another term. In our sample vocabulary, you see we have all these buttons, and they Genius. open they open up to pages and so on. Okay. Home page. And we have a calendar button. Calendar. Now let's go um, about me. About me. And let's suppose I want this button or this button doesn't matter to go to my calendar page I already have the calendar page I just want to create a button that links to it okay so what I do is I press the edit button in the top right hand corner and I touch the button and I hit edit now this button here that I'm looking at just so you just for a moment here let me show you something the reason you don't see the lines is the border width has been set to zero see that if I make it I'll make it fatter just so you can get an example there see I made it five okay let's go back in there okay I want this button to link to my calendar page so I hit edit I touch the button I choose the edit choice here and I come down here to well let's give it a symbol first and we'll say we're linking it to the calendar page so let's type in here calendar Here's calendar. And linked page. This is key. See that? Touch that button, and now you'll see a list of all your pages that are in the system that you've already set up or you've created or that are already there. And right here, you see it says calendar. I just touch it as a checkbox. Come up here, press done. And you'll see now where it says linked page, it says calendar. That's all I need to do. Now I could put a, a uh, have a label on there now. Um, if I wanted it to say calendar, I could type that in here. If I didn't want it to speak, I could put nothing in there or turn it off or whatever. And uh, I hit done. Calendar. Hit done again. Watch what happens. I touch it. Calendar on the calendar page. Now if I had a go back or return button I could have it go right back to where I came from. So let's do that. I'll hit edit. I'll have that button just because it's convenient. I'll have that be my go back button. I touch it. I hit edit. And I will say return. Or go back. Whatever you want to say. It doesn't matter. Under Actions, I will say Previous Page. I'll turn these ones off. So now it just says Previous Page. And um, let's give it a symbol. And now I'll type in here Return. So Label, Symbol, Action is previous page. I hit done. I hit done. When I press it, there I'm back. So that's the calendar button I just created. I touch it. Calendar. And now I'm on this page. And I hit return. It takes me back. As an example, home page. Let's suppose I was on my home page. And I went to calendar. Calendar. And I hit return this time back to my home page. It's that simple.